100 days have passed since Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck put their $68 million Los Angeles mansion, Crestview Manor, on the market in anticipation of their divorce. Earlier this year, Lopez and Affleck relisted the lavish 38,000-square-foot home they bought for $60.8 million in May of 2023. The property has 12 bedrooms and 24 bathrooms. The couple is about to separate. They oversaw a series of upgrades on the 5.2-acre property and are now seeking $68 million. On Monday, Jason Oppenheim of Selling Sunset assured Lopez and Affleck that the slow sale pace was nothing to be concerned about in an interview with Realtor.com. It would have been surprising for the house to sell in less than 100 days, the co-founder of the Oppenheim Group said with the news source. The average time a house of this size spends on the market is six months, and sometimes much more. Noting that the pool of possible purchasers is significantly fewer owing to the enormous financial expenditures linked with the sale, the outlet highlighted a number of important reasons why the former couple should not be alarmed by the 100-day requirement. Per Realtor.com, those with the financial means to do so often tour numerous houses and patiently await a possible price drop. Included in this figure is the anticipated $283,666 that the homeowner will have to pay each month in taxes, security fees, and HOA dues Home features include a 5,000-square-foot penthouse, a guardhouse with two bedrooms, a caretaker's residence, and a garage that can accommodate 12 automobiles. It competes with other luxury homes in the greater Los Angeles region. According to the source, there are other lavish homes on the market alongside Lopez and Affleck's. One of these is the Trousdale Estates Estate, owned by sports equipment magnate James Jannard, which has been listed for around 25 days longer. More over two years ago, the Beverly Hills mansion known as The Peak went on the market with a price tag of $65 million, which is equivalent, with seven bedrooms and 15 bathrooms spread across 17,500 square feet. This Beverly Hills mansion was reduced from $64 million to $56.9 million in July. Reducing the total amount of time a home has been on the market in promotional materials is a standard practice in the sector according to the outlet, which is why houses are taken off the market and put back on at irregular intervals.